I spent far too many years in an identity crisis after having my biological father walk out when I was three years old, never to see him again. Transitioning that and the hard life in between to 45 years old and watching my 93 year old grandmother weep tears of joy when I took her maiden name as my last name as the icing on the cake and finally finding my authentic identity. She didn't need to know any of the details in between of that. I also discovered an cackly unapologetic laugh that was surprised me as who I was after decades of being such a chameleon and lost in who I was and copying and mimicking what other people were doing. I learned that knowing that what I was using as a coping mechanism in overcoming the tragedies and obstacles in my life was actually okay to be, it was appropriate to interject humor and use high intellect in conversations. My life, even though I was faking it, and maybe many of you can relate to this, it actually, that whole story was still my true authentic life story. All of the things that happened to me along the way, I have learned, put me in a special club with other people who have been through it too. Relatedness became my superpower. Learning how, where to find it in other people and how to use it is the key. I'm unstoppable. My journey's very inspiring. I'm Mary McConnell and I create space for young adults to see obstacles as opportunities and live their most authentic life. As a woman in leadership in an engineering field that is male dominated, I specifically reach out to teen girls who are interested in being in the field and are have fear that they aren't good enough, smart enough, don't have the money, I will help you overcome any and all of those obstacles. No excuses.